A giant to the left of Wentz. Third and goal. Wentz back. Wentz looking. Steps up. Firing for the end zone. Touchdown! Alshon Alshon Jeffrey again. All right, we're joined by Eagles receivers coach Gunther Brewer now, and this was special, seeing Alshon Jeffrey back on the field. Take us through this touchdown here. You got Alshon down here. And what was the setup of this play, and how effective was he with his body in the end zone? Absolutely. We set it in a three-by-one set, being one receiver to the left and three receivers to the right. You see Nelson, and, you know, we're in great shape with two, two speed receivers here, and we're going to come off and drive the corner off and then give him a double move inside. They're going to have to put two on him. Corner takes the bait, and then we're going to bend it back outside. With that, we've got a guy that's going to tie down the underneath defender right here with Ertz, and they have to give him respect. And if they don't want to double him, and we can come back and we got mm-hmm. Nelson over the top and backside, we're going to hold this guy down here. So we got multiple ways to get the ball to all our playmakers right here. But you see the respect as you come out right here. He's going to stick his foot in the ground. He's going to turn his head and go three steps to the post now. And that's going to lock down this safety. He's going to play over the top and it's going to enable him to come back out of a tight turn and put himself in position to body up, go up high, and get the ball. This was the first ball to Alshon. What a beautiful ball by Carson here. Carson was so accurate. Tell us uh, how impressive this was because Alshon only had one full practice this week on a Wednesday because he missed the next two with a virus. That's correct. And uh, to come out in the weather conditions that we had and, and what he was dealing with was just a great individual effort. But again, you see us in a three-by-one set. Now we put ourselves in what we call a bunch set, which we knew by then that they would man-to-man this. So you you see he's going to take this one, he's going to take this one, he's going to take this one. So we knew by coming out pregame that what we were going to get. So with that, we designed a play here that we get an opportunity to put him one-on-one with a smaller corner. With the outside release, now we call it the big box fade. If you'll stop it real quick, now we got an opportunity to see all this room out here mm-hmm. for him to get the ball over the outside shoulder. We can either back shoulder it or we can put it up and feather it over the top in all this room out here. We got Nelson out here drawing attention. We knew in man coverage he would come with him. If not, we had a check down on this side and a high low back on this side. So we had an opportunity to get the ball different places, but with one-on-one coverage, we're going to take Alshon every day. All right, and let's take a look at, of course, Jordan Matthews, his first touchdown back with the Eagles. He and Carson have a good chemistry, and they were able to connect on a 56-yard touchdown. How much of this is also what you see during the week and then in-game with the way you're able to get a matchup here? Well, what's great about the passing game is we're in a two-by-two set here, one receiver here, one receiver here, one here, one here. So we've got a combination on back both sides of the field. In this case, we're hoping to get quarters defense, which means everybody's got a fourth of the field. They're splitting it up by quarters right here. They played quarters, him being a flat player, him being a flat player. So now we're going to do our best to get a post and a mm-hmm. corner route and then someone in the flat to affect this player so they can't drop underneath it. Now it's based on how this safety wants to play it. If he wants to stay high and over the top, then we know we got the corner route underneath. If he wants to take the bait and jump down on the corner route, which you'll see Ertz here, which is pretty good bait, by the way, <laughs> then we're going to take the, cor- the, the post high and over the top. He does a great job of raging up the field, sticking his foot in the ground, and getting high and over the safety, and then just sprint to the end zone. Backside combination, we are able to tie these guys down also with Nelson screaming up the field and then tight end coming back underneath here. You see what I'm saying by the safety now, jumping on this defender here, jumping on the, the corner out. Now we got the post over the top. We got great leverage by him playing outside, we're inside, and then we're way up over the top, and you see all the green grass back here for us to lay it up and, and run underneath it. I believe you can make that play. Tape Study is brought to you by Chickies and Peeps, proud partner of the Philadelphia Eagles.